Okay, well, um, what can you do here? If you multiply top and bottom by the conjugate, you could think of this as actually 0 plus i. So you'd want to multiply top and bottom by 0 minus i. That would be the conjugate. In fact, in this problem, it turns out to be so easy, you can just multiply top and bottom by i if you wanted to. But just to be consistent, even though that would be perfectly fine, and if I were in private, I would do that. But to be consistent, I'll multiply top and bottom by the conjugate. So the conjugate of i is actually minus i. And if I do that, what do I see? Well, I have to distribute now. Everything has to get hit with that thing. Don't need to FOIL now because it's such a simple, such a simple thing on top. So I'd see a, a minus 6i. And then let's see, a minus and a plus is a minus i squared. So a minus i squared is a minus minus 1, which is a plus 1. And on the bottom, I'm left with an i times an i. That's i squared. So that's minus i squared. But minus i squared is minus minus 1, which is 1. So in fact, this just turns out to be 1 minus 6i. So that one was not too bad to, to compute. Let's try one last one together. Let's find the reciprocal of 2 plus i. So that means I'm looking for 1 over 2 plus i. How would you do that? Well, I'll give you a chance to do it right now. So see if you can figure out what the reciprocal of, one, uh, of 2 plus i is.